Hey, it's Brickzar. In this video, we're going to look at a set from 1967, and we're also going to answer a bet about plates. Vintage Lego set. This is a truck, believe it or not. <laughs> it's a semi trailer truck and it came out in 1967 so it's an old one older than bricks are even so it's got 72 pieces I think it's got a lot of standard bricks and quite a few printed bricks uh, a lot of my blues here because I used uh, old bricks they are faded or ultraviolet light has hurt them and it's got steering now this is one of these large vehicles. Uh, this was uh, the early original wheels that Lego made. And these large vehicle sets were pretty pretty neat. They were made to be like models, like something you might have a whole bunch of them. And the city would be a lot larger. Actually, they're closer to minifigure scale than the, the vehicles they had in the 70s, if, if you ask me. Uh, I still can't fit a minifigure in there, although it does have opening doors. Really wasn't designed to put people in this 1967. And if you're wondering what that shaft is in the middle of the truck, that's the axle that goes down to the wheel so you can steer it. So if the kid was playing with it, he could just steer it that way. Now on the bottom of the truck, there's supposed to be a pin here where you can kind of lock it into position. Now mine has broken off, but I actually prefer it that way because it just... Yeah, when it, 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 it just gets hard to deal, deal with and have it already broken off, you don't have to worry about it. But that's the way it works. It's got an old turntable there. Don't have a little piece that comes down to hold it when you separate the trailer. And But a lot of printed tiles. you got the four 1x2 with the old Lego logo. you got the transport logo there. And then this old Lego logo here on on the brick. This was very, all the large vehicle sets had this. So anyway, I just thought I'd show you a vintage Lego set from 1967. I do have the instructions. It says model maker on the instructions, set 334. There's the old color bars there. And there's what the inside of the instructions look like. I've got a few tears on them. And then it shows you how you can motorize your sets. <laughs> and there's some other of the Lego trucks. I'm working on building that yellow truck there. I want to get all of the Lego yellow trucks. So stay tuned for that as that project is ongoing. But I thought I'd show you this. And we're going to do a bat. So let's get to the bat. <laughs> So our bat question today comes from Mardi Gras Man 23. Is it's bat? When did Lego start building plates? And that's because a lot of the sets that I've looked at uh, are shown you. A lot of them just have standard bricks or very few plates. And that's a good question because it's kind of got a weird answer, I guess. Uh, maybe not weird. Just uh, some of the plates they made may not be ones that you would think of. And some of them didn't come around till later. So what we're going to do is we're going to stroll over to BrickLink here. And we're going to go to the catalog. And we're just going to type in plates. And I, I know the numbers of a lot of them. but Because um, when you deal with BrickLink stores, you, 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 you see these plates all the time. Like the 2x4 plate there. That's actually a set of them. So we'll go down here to where the individual plates are. There's six by eights. Quicker if I just go right to the, the item number. So now we're into base plates. So I'll just go to the item number. And this is the two by four plate, 3020. So we click in 3020. There's a set. Oh, Raft of Johns. I need to get that set. Uh, that's Johnny Thunder, I guess. Anyway, here's the two by four uh, plate. And what we can do is, now I just clicked on plate, now we see all the plates, individual plates. Now, 2x4 plate, 
is one that's a pretty old one. Came out in 1962, and that's it, it, sometimes they're not accurate on Bricklink, but that's when this plate began. It's 1962. Now this truck transport set that I'm reviewing, it's got two by two plates, two by four plates, one by two plates, and a six by 24 plate, but it doesn't have a one by four. And a lot of these old vintage sets like this, they just string together a bunch of one by twos. And I'm like, why don't they use a one by four? Or a one by six or a one by eight. Well, let's go to the one by four. Watch this. It came out in 1977. So we didn't get any one by fours until 1977. So that's why all these old sets, they don't have them. Uh, so in 1962, you had basically the two by four, the one by one. The which is up here, and the one by two, 1962. Did I what, what year did I say? It came out in 1962. So you had two by four, one by one, one by two, two by two, and two by three. But there are plates older than that. Uh, your one by eight actually came out before the one by four. The one by eight, I think, the first set it came in. There it is, 3460 is in 1972. So what is older? It'd be the 2x8 plate. Let's, I'm just going to type the number in for the 2x8 plate. And there are two different versions, but um, we'll just go to 3034 first. All right, that goes all the way back to 1958. But if you do the old version, which is the waffle version, it goes back to 1955. So that's pretty old. Um, so the regular 2x8 goes back to 1958, the waffled version, 1955, but I bet you they're all waffle. Uh, sometimes these inventories aren't exactly accurate. So 55, but that is not the oldest. The oldest is this one, 30, 35 old. 1954, the 4x8 <laughs> with waffle bottom. That's the oldest that I can find. Uh, so if you, anybody knows of an older one, uh, feel free to leave a comment below. But it's just interesting uh, to me and to Mardi Gras Man, <laughs> uh, the, the, the evolution of them introducing plates. So you had just a couple of plates. You had the 2x8, the 6x8, and the 2x8. See, the 2x8, 6x8, and the 4x8 up through the 50s. And it wasn't until the 19, 1962 that you started getting... Uh, the 2 by 2s and 2 by 4s and 1 by 1s and 1 by 2s And it wasn't until the 70s and really the late 70s before you started getting 1 by 6s and 2 by 6s. You think the 2 by 6 plate, you think that would be fairly common. Look at it. The 2 by 6 plate came out in 1978. So, uh, so you can tell sometimes if a set, uh, if it has a 2 by 6 plate, it was produced least after so thanks for watching this video of the lego vintage semi tractor trailer truck set 334 and also thanks to mardi gras man 23 for the question about when did lego introduce plates into the building system and so be sure to subscribe for more vintage lego reviews and be sure to leave questions and i will get to them as i can can't answer every question we'll try to answer as many as i can so thank you for watching this video. It's Brickzard.